How's it going guys? My name is DJ Technic ZRT and here I have another theory video for you guys. Before we delve deep into the theory, I want to let you guys know that we did make a pretty awesome channel trailer for LabZ. Um, if you're already subscribed, which most of you are, you probably don't see it on your front page, but if you want to check it out, it's going to be right here below. Simple, clean, pretty effective, it's pretty awesome. Check it out. Three months ago, Steambot Studio, the creators of the Buried Intro, had released every single frame that had been used in the intro in the game. If you want to reference that video before you go in deep into this video, it is going to be right here below as well. The main significance of the video was that there was one piece of artwork that was never ever used. And here you can see me roaming around Mutiny Multiplayer, which is one of the new maps that is released for Call of Duty Ghosts. I am speculating that Mutiny had to have been a scrapped zombie map for Black Ops 2 and they had used the code, the map, for a multiplayer map for Call of Duty Ghost that was pushed. For whatever reason, Treyarch didn't use it. This is my theory. But if you look at the mutiny map and you look at the image right here, you can see that the resemblance is pretty much uncanny. There's a huge pirate ship in the map and you can see Russman, Misty, and Marlton in the crow's nest here shooting zombies that are pirates. Pirate zombies. Now, I'm not saying that this exact multiplayer map could have been the huge zombie map that we could be playing in Treyarch's game, but what I am saying that there are some elements that seem pretty zombie related. For example, of course the pirate ship is one of them. This could have been very well been one of the boss zombies that walked around the map. Maybe Blackbeard's captain, whatever the hell you want to call it. Another really intriguing part of this map is the Flirt Folly Tavern. It kind of reminds me of Buried, and it reminds me of the bar in Buried. Um, there are skeletons that are sitting everywhere. They're kind of like little Easter eggs, and they got mugs in their hands. Who knows, we could have triggered some sort of Easter egg or some sort of small Easter egg, shooting all the mugs out of the skeleton's hands. Maybe uh, a song or something like that. You can hear crazy echoes and whisperings in the walls. I'm gonna see if I can turn this up for you guys so you guys can really, really hear it because I know when you guys play multiplayer, I know when I play multiplayer, I never hear any of this stuff because I'm too busy raging. Another really cool little Easter egg, I guess you wanna say that I found was the little uh, Chinese dragon or Chinese lion dragon looking thing that you actually have in this little witch doctor shop. Um, it was, if you remember playing the Easter egg for Die Rise, which I definitely do, um, there was a one part where you had to shoot the balls under the paws. And this is the same exact one. And I know Call of Duty likes to recycle stuff a lot, but this is the only time I've really seen it in a multiplayer map. And then I'm theorizing that this multiplayer map could have been something that was scrapped for zombies. So it may be coincidence, but this is actually a pretty cool find. And this kind of solidifies my theory a little bit more just because we have old zombie elements um, from previous games in this multiplayer map. Another element that I spotted was the unfinished cannon that was actually hanging off of a crane. Um, I don't know, maybe we could have put this thing together and used it to shoot some zombies. I'm not too certain, or maybe shoot some ships that were across the way, but that's another element that could have been used in a zombie map if this were some sort of zombie map that was scrapped. But there is one thing that doesn't make sense about this map is the size, which it could have been it could have been shortened for a multiplayer map. It could have been much larger at some point. And there is no crow's nest up in the ship, which we know from the image seen here again, there is a crow's nest that um, our zombie survivalists are up in so this could have definitely been put out or you know deleted out of the multiplayer map just to see or just to make sure to salvage this map as it not being something that was recycled from a zombie map maybe people didn't want to speculate so much because the crow's nest might have been a huge dead giveaway if people know about the steambot studio unreleased image that's all the theories I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like. Please subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Let's talk. This is DJ for LabZ. I am out. Follow the research on Twitter at Nashar Zanal. Subscribe now.